everyone I've got an unboxing for you today in fact I have two unboxings for you I have got Princess Elena of Avalor and I have got Naomi Turner who is a member of the council that helps the princess make royal decisions I know that because I read it on the back of the box yeah Naomi Turner is a down-to-earth city girl and member of the Grand Council who helps the Crown Princess make her royal decisions. And there's a picture of her on the back of the box. This I assume is Avalor. We have the warnings here, the choking hazard. We have Made in China, Hasbro logo. At the top we've got Disney Channel. $7.99, I got it from TK Maxx. She's got short blonde hair, an unusual face, which I like. I like the colour of her dress. It reminds me a little bit of Anna from Anna and Elsa. She's got on her long black boots. Another picture of her there. And it says, Eleanor of Avalor. Naomi Turner, age three plus Hasbro. So, yeah. And then for Eleanor herself, beautiful doll. I do have a couple of Eleanors, but I didn't have a Disney one and none of mine are articulated. So it's nice to get one that's got actually got some articulation. She has a beautiful face. I love her skin. I love the colour they use for her dress. It says Eleanor of Avalor, warning choking hazard, three plus. It has the Disney store logo at the top here. It says Eleanor, Eleanor of Avalor classic doll on the back. Shows you the picture here of the princess, and this is her little sister. I think she's called Sophia. I'm not, but I may have got that wrong. Yeah, and there is the rest of the characters. She was thirteen pounds from the Disney store. So let's get them out of the box. So here we have Eleanor. So a good look at her. So she's got beautiful big brown eyes, she has red lips, deep red lips, she's got on her dangly earrings, love those. Her hair is absolutely as stiff as a board, look at that, it really is so stiff, there's no giving it at all, it, it could be plastic, it's so stiff, look at that, it really is absolutely, you can feel it, hear it can't you, it's absolutely and it's so shiny it's like gelled to high heavens it would need well i don't know whether you dare boil wash it but something needs doing with it and even her fringe is absolutely as stiff as a board the whole it looks like that she's been dipped in a tub of gel and then styled she's got a little flower in her hair that's pretty her dress is a lovely color i love that like deep coral color She's got on a little belt. Her belt does pop open at the back there. The dress does up with Velcro. So her dress is this cream under layer and over the top she has this um, deep coral I'd call it over skirt with a frill all around the edges. Nicely patterned delicate frill. She has glitter all over her dress all over the top and the ruffle around the top matches the, the ruffle or the frill around the edge of the overskirt. Gorgeous. She's got her lasso, which is like elastic to her hands. I'm going to leave that on there. She has a little bracelet, which is really pretty. It's like gold with the golden turquoise. Can you see that? Yeah, really pretty. Her shoes are... Actually, I'm not really keen on those shoes, but let's see. There we go. Yeah, no, I'm not really keen on those shoes. They're not my favourite. They're quite low, which is nice, and I suppose they're quite intricate, but they're just not... Well, I don't know. They're just not very princessy, I don't think. Her legs are bend and snap. She has bend and snap knees. She has some tissue up her skirt to help hold her dress out. She has articulation at the shoulder, the elbow and the wrist and her head 
it's quite nicely articulated she can move it up and down and side to side she needs to be able to with that blooming weighted hair doesn't she yeah she can move her head quite nicely it's quite a nice articulation there so let's have a look at Naomi Naomi has a greeny blue eye, turquoise almost eyes, and a pink lip. Her hair as well is very, very gelled. It's really stiff, stiff to her head. It's Yeah, it needs washing as well. It's really, really stiff. A lot of product on there, and they're made by different companies, I believe. She has on her top, the detail of which is painted on, she has a little blue necklace there. Do you think it's like meant to be like a choker? Her skirt is two layered. You've got like the silky underlayer, and then you've got the like netting over the top, and it's quite shimmery. The netting bit is, and she has on these quite detailed boots. You can see the lace detail up the side there. She's got like a little detail here. No articulation in her legs at all, and none in her arms. But then she did cost half the price of the Disney doll. So that's fair enough. So that was my Eleanor of Avalor doll unboxing and review. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.